Hey guys, it is Tyler here, back once again. Another Assassin's Creed video. This is another Empire leak. You've probably already heard about this by now. Ethan, George, James, they've all covered it. They've all talked about it. I want to give you guys my thoughts on this supposed Assassin's Creed Empire gameplay leak screenshot that's been around apparently for a month. And then it's just kind of resurfaced again and has come to our attention now. We've been getting leaks on Empire that are fake every single fucking day and I hate it and I've talked about that I don't want to cover fake leaks but this hasn't been confirmed to be fake yet and I don't know how we could confirm it to be fake yet so I don't want to say it's fake I don't know if it is there's actually a good chance this could be real as well so we'll have a look at it now the only reason I could think of James kept saying uh there's no reason to believe it's fake not that there's a bunch of reasons to believe it's real but there's no, nothing we can look at and be like mm, that makes it look fake the only thing I can think of is like what if it's from another game that someone's modded a bit and then you know made it look like it's a leak like people go really elaborate with this shit but I've, I mean I talked to James and he said they've been looking and trying to find anything that can make it fake because we want to prove it's fake, and if we can't, then it's like, well, okay, this might be legitimate. We don't have a reason to believe it's fake. And if James says he spent all this time doing it with, like, Ethan and stuff, I trust him. And I've had a look around, and I've been trying to see, and I haven't been able to find any reason that this leak is fake. So, I'll leave two links in the description to, like, the the two pictures. Because one was, like, a month ago, the person on Reddit, and the other's been the last 24 hours or so. Uh, that's just kind of a closer view of that screenshot. Now... Obviously, when games are early in development and you're they're in pre-rendered and um, sorry, they're yeah before they've been rendered or anything like that, they're gonna look pretty shit. And this looks really shitty in terms of like uh, resolution and all that sort of stuff. But then even the writing's really it has really bad resolution as well. So I don't necessarily know if that's the game that's bad resolution because the if it was in let's say in a development engine, that writing that has on the bottom on the side to say would look normal, but it's the gameplay that would look really bad resolution, badly pixelated, but it all does, so it's just kind of like someone's taking a photo of a screen, so I don't really know, that's the only thing I'm looking at that I'm like, oh, that doesn't match up to say that it is necessarily in a game engine, but then again, I'm not a fucking game developer, so I'm not 100% sure either. Um, now... Speaking of the fact that I guess I've got no reason yet looking at it to be like that is fake for sure. Now let's look and let's just assume it's real for a second. Uh, obviously, it's ancient Egypt, which is fantastic. Uh, we also have things like it, it looks like he's got van braces where he could have hidden blades. He has a sword. He has a shield on his back with the what looks like the assassin logo or a, an older rendition of the assassin logo. Uh, and what else do we have? He, he kind of looks like some of the concept art people have been coming up with, like, you know, has, like, the hood on the shoulders, kind of like, he doesn't have a full cloak and robes on, right? He's just kind of got the, a little bit of a cloth that sits on the shoulders, and it looks like he's not wearing the hood at the time, but maybe he has the hood behind the shield there that he has, hasn't raised up or anything like that. Uh, what else? Uh... I mean, it looks like, I don't know, I can't really tell because of the resolution, but he's got some more weapons on his back as well that aren't the sword. Perhaps that's some sort of uh, equipment, because it looks like obviously he's going into some sort of tomb, which, I mean, you know how much I just my pants over tomb, so that's fucking awesome if that's the case. Um, and looks like he's got some sort of, like, maybe excavation sort of equipment to dig shit up, maybe. That's something he carries around, uh, especially if he's perhaps some sort of... Well, if he's going to a sarcophagus, he's looking for some fucking treasures, fucking riches, and all that sort of shit. Uh, so, it could be, potentially, uh, be an involving factor of his character, and that's uh, something he does, a tomb raider of some kind. A treasure hunter? I have no idea. Uh, and that looks super interesting, to be honest, and it's got... What else does it have? Obviously, you've got some spiderwebs. I mean, it's all hard to tell, because it all looks really badly pixelated and it looks really like old and ancient game but i'm hoping that if this is real obviously it's not going to look like it does in the sc screenshot obviously but you know it, it, it's hard to tell it even has the normal what we'd expect from this age of assassin's creed games when you've set a waypoint to a mission where it's got at the door entrance way it's kind of got highlighted with the little logo above it saying you're five meters away like, it looks how an Assassin's Creed game in Egypt would look, 
if it was made on the PlayStation 1 or the Wii U. Same thing. And it's not great. But, you know, that's... Again, it's not what it would actually look like. It's just a bad screenshot, you know, photo taken of a screen. So, at the end of the day, it's so hard to tell. It's not enough to sit here for me to tell you it's real. It's not enough for me to sit here and tell you it's fake at this point. Uh, hopefully, we'll be able to see more. But it's interesting. Like, honestly, this is the first leak since the original one that I'm looking at. Like, that's actually interesting. It's kind of stuff I was hoping to see. I was advocating for these tombs. I was advocating for ancient Egypt. This looks kind of good. I don't know. I'm I'm interested to see more. I'm looking forward to the next leaks. Better screenshots. Uh, Kotaku, is there any way you can help us out and leak everything as you normally do? That would be great as well, you know? Um, so it's interesting at this point. And we're just going to have to wait and see, to be honest. That's my thoughts on it. I like it. I'm interested. I'm intrigued. I know the guys are intrigued as well, George and James and Ethan and stuff, so we're all going to be sitting around waiting at this point. It's it's coming up to March now, which means, whew, oh boy. Stuff's going to be coming in the next month or two, I think. I'd expect, yeah, between March and May, we're going to be getting something, I'd expect. Probably, I'd expect, because Assassin's Creed a leak first, some sort of Kotaku leak. Um, But... If Ubisoft have it their way, they're probably going to wait till like May, before e, right before E3, and do a, an event similar to what they did to Watch Dogs 2, unless it gets leaked, and they always get leaked, so it is what it is. Let me know, guys, what you think of the screenshots down in the comments below, I'd like to know, uh, and if anyone has any reason to believe it's real or fake that's legitimate, tell me, because I'm not here to tell you 100% whether it's real or fake for sure, so if you're sitting here like, Tyler, this is obviously fake, and this is why, and you have a real reason... Let me know. Like, I'd like to know whether it's real or fake. So help me out, guys. Obviously, let's work as a community to solve the mysteries of all these fucking Empire leaks. Um, and I'll see you guys very soon with more Assassin's Creed fantastic content. And that's it. I'm out. That was weird. I'm not doing that again. What the fuck was that?